So my artwork has the color scheme ma mainly. You know, I try to keep these very uh, popping, vivid colors. I look, I look, I look back to uh, the '80s Miami, the Neon Knights, the Miami Vice. You get me all the aesthetics that usually are associated with Miami, and I put that into my work, and then I take it all to the United States and throughout the world. You know, to make sure that we have a, we have a presence wherever my foot lands. Being of the 305 is basically embracing, embracing a culture that was created by this huge melting pot of Latin, Caribbean, American, um, uh, African American, and all types of all types of people, all walks of life. You know, and uh, the fact that we have our own distinct uh, uniqueness to us. My work basically is influenced a lot through animals, uh, uh, floral patterns, you know, nature, because I feel that nature is um, is closer to humans' actual instincts than ourselves, you know, because I feel like us humans, we're always trying to uh, create a facade, right? We're trying to be something that we're not, uh, just to uh, comply with society's standards. As Friedrich Nietzsche once said, you know, he he would view artists as more than just mortals and we're bound to our to our physical existence. But the fact that we can we can create worlds and invite people into these places. And as an artist, I take great pride in like being able to inspire uh, the, the youth, especially. FIU again, to me, feels like home. I'm not going to lie. There's times there where I'm where I where I do miss going back, going to school. Uh, I graduated 2017. I mean, the fact that you know, I'm like one of the first people in my uh, in my family to get a degree. You know, I'm, like, I'm first generation American. Everybody is all immigrants in my family for the most part. All the students and alumni that leave there, they go, they, they go to do great things, you know, and to pursue higher ventures, you know, and it has a good, it has a good system. My message as an artist, for the, main, for the most part, is purpose. You know, we have to find purpose within ourselves. We have to find purpose in everything that we do. And we have to find purpose in the world, you know, because without that, we're just adrift, you know, alone until we find, until we, until we find what we're looking for.